drinking. I was high. I don't remember everything clearly. Okay. But I was stealing from a purse, and she snuck up on me, and I hit her. I didn't mean to. Purely reactionary, but, and I ran. I, I mean, I didn't know what else to do. Okay. You know, and, uh, that's the only reason I didn't come forward before. Okay. I mean, I just, I can't lie. I can't live with myself. I'm so sick of this stuff. I think there's other people that feel the same way you do, too, don't you think? No, sir. Okay. I'm tired. And my family's good people. I didn't want to do this to them. Okay. Know. Let's take a break. You want something to drink? No, sir. I'm fine. Okay. I've, I've thought about this. It seems like my world's been ha loose by a thread, and I've been holding on to that thread for so long, I'm fucking wrapped up in it. You know, it's... Well, you're doing the right thing. No, sir, I'm not. I right should, now, you are. If I'd been a man, I'd have, I'd have done something It doesn't else. matter when. Yes, okay. it does. Fear is fear, but you're doing the right thing now. I don't feel like it. Well, I'm telling you. No. Having done this for a long time, this is very... I can see it on your face. I, I could tell yesterday that this was bothering you. All right. Slow down. Let's back up a little. Yes, sir. What night did you go to her house? Strung out. I was working at a factory, working seventy some hours a week, and, and it, it was in September, I think, uh, later in the year, the fall, the exact year. I don't know. Everything's just been upside down since then. Okay. Okay. You went to her house. How did you get into her house? Uh, it's easy. Uh, pop a dead bolt. You can pop a lot real easy. I mean, I broke into people. I never steal more.
So that's back up. So one night, sometime in the fall, I'm assuming this is around the time that she went missing. Yes, sir. Okay. And part of what you did led into her being missing, right? No, sir. She died. When I, hit her. I lived. And I, I got so scared, I went home, but I didn't even go inside. I turned around and lived. And there wasn't no cops around or anything like that. And I knew she was hurt.
as you go and you pick up her body. Um, you put it, I'm assuming you're, this is still in Bo's truck. And you put it in the back or did you put it in the front seat? She didn't have any clothes on when you yes, sir. Yeah, no clothes on. Okay. Do you know what you so everything I mean this is afterwards, so yes, sir. you know, you probably come down from whatever you were on. But yes, sir. If she did, I, I don't know how did. Somebody did. Did Bo help you take her clothes off? So you take her out to where? To cremate her? It was a field in Fitzgerald. Uh, off of people. Places where Bowen, you know, I guess he threw a party or two out there from time yes, to time. Sir, was, I was familiar with it, yes, sir. Okay. So I'm assuming this is Saturday night now. This is late Saturday night, early Sunday morning when you lose the body. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, so now we're rolling. And, uh, and you left her there because y'all didn't, you didn't burn her the same day you dropped the body out there, did you? Yes, sir. And your conscience got the better of me and you went and told those Sunday that you had done it, didn't you? Yes, sir. After you picked her up, did you ever go back again? Did you ever make any phone calls to the house or anything like that? No, sir. I mean, I don't know. Well, we know some phone calls got made to her house early Sunday. Well, that's when I called. I wanted to. I hadn't got her at that point. Okay. I, I called. I was hoping she was okay. And How did you call? What did you do? Uh, from a pay phone. Okay. I, I called okay. the number. Okay. Gloves. I know there were some gloves at the house. Is that going to have your DNA on it? It should. That's okay. that was mine. That's, I just, I just, was it just accidental leaving the glove? It was pure accident? Yes, sir. You go and get Bo, and you two go right back out there, and you told him what you had done again. Yes, and he probably still didn't believe you, but you kind of had to prove it to him, didn't you? Yes, and out there, and her body's still where you left it, correct? Yes. same spot? Yes, sir. Do you remember where this spot is? Yes, sir. Could you take us there? I probably could. I mean... You haven't been back since? No, sir. Has this been the only time that anything like this has ever happened before? Like, there, there isn't anybody else that we need to worry no, about or be looking no, into? Sir. I, I never heard another, another person on the same that would have done them. Thinking all night last night, I considered myself a good person, but how can I be? Accidents happen. No, yes, sir. It, it, uh, out of fear, our family has suffered. Bothering a long time, haven't you? Yes, sir.
else you know does your brother know? Ever confront you about it?
just move them over to theirs because we're going to have to look through your house. Okay. You understand? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, this is, these are cotton swabs. Um, what I'm going to do is inside of your mouth, on each side for about 10 seconds. I'm going to air dry them and then we'll pull them back in here. And then um, we're going to seal it up and we're going to do that together. Yes, sir. Okay. Put your initials, see how I did mine? Yes, sir. Over half and half. I need you to do the same thing on that bottom part. 